Yesterday at this time, we showed you how artists are transforming a stretch of San Francisco's JFK Drive ahead of a vote on whether it should remain closed two cars for good. And less than 24 hours later, they were back out repairing one of those murals after vandals scrawled over it. Ann Makovic joins us now with a look at the ugly response to the mural's message. And Ann Elizabeth, you profiled this mural project along JFK Drive yesterday uh, that's been partially ruined this morning. One of the mural artists found this, the mural which originally said, we are on native land, had been covered with black paint with writing that said no such thing. The artist told KPIX 5 this morning that they won't be discouraged by the quote cowardly racist act and that the mission to educate must continue. The American Indian Cultural District designed and funded the mural. They say they're not surprised by the vandalism because they did get some negative feedback right off the bat. There were people who were like, you know, you're just trying to steal the land and Indians aren't here and Native people don't exist. So I knew that with something um, that had this, this statement with it, that there was potential for people to come and, and really show where we are and that there is a lot of truth and a lot of healing that still needs to be done. Now she says they've also gotten a lot of positive feedback on the mural and they are committed to keeping it in place. She says having it in Golden Gate Park is an honor to the original stewards of the land, the hawks, the coyotes, the trees, and the plants. That mural is also part of Indigenized Project SF. They're using murals and walking tours to tell the stories of Native people in San Francisco. All right, thanks, Anne.